Alec Murdoch is changing his story once again, this time from a prison cell. After admitting during his trial to lying about his alibi the night his wife and son were killed. I did lie to them. Murdoch is now confessing to even more lies, this time surrounding the mysterious death of the family's longtime housekeeper, Gloria Satterfield. She died at the Murdoch home after allegedly suffering a fall in 2018. The disgraced lawyer originally told his insurance company that the family's dogs caused her to trip and fall. He later collected millions in settlement money intended for Satterfield's sons, who say they never saw any of it. Did you ever get one cent from Alec Murdoch when he was still um, before all of this happened? No. Back in 2021, Satterfield's son Tony told Craig Alec Murdoch promised he would help him and his brother get an insurance settlement for the accident. Did you believe him? Yeah, of course. Well, why not? He said, I want to make sure the boys are taken care of because he loved Gloria that much. Now, a legal storm is brewing over Murdoch's latest confession. In a new statement made in response to a recent lawsuit filed by an insurance company looking to recover the $3.8 million it paid Murdoch for Satterfield's death, Murdoch now claims he fabricated his initial story, writing, no dogs were involved in Satterfield's death, adding he invented the situation to force his insurers to make a settlement payment. Murdoch also says the Satterfield family did actually receive the fraudulent funds. Lawyers for the Satterfields family deny they got money from the insurance company, saying the new claims lack credibility, much like Alec Murdoch. The question is, is Alex to be believed? Alex at this point in time will say anything to uh, try to preserve his own skin. Police have reopened the investigation into Satterfield's death. We reached out to Murdoch's attorney who had no comment about the lawsuit or why Alec Murdoch is once again changing his story from behind bars. Murdoch is currently serving two life sentences for the murders of his wife and son, but is also facing nearly a hundred other charges ranging from money laundering to stealing money from his clients. Murdoch's attorneys have filed a notice to appeal, say they plan to do so in coming months. Craig? Kitty Beck for us there in the Walterboro, South Carolina. Katie, thank you. All right, let's bring in NBC senior legal correspondent Laura Jarrett. Laura, good morning. I confess I do not understand why it's a head scratcher. admitting this in a legal filing helps his case with the insurer at all. But the the question is, is the insurer the insurer wants to try to get the money back from Alec Murdoch. He says go find it from the, the family, but he admits that he kept the money, didn't give it to the family. Precisely, right? This whole thing was sort of a lie built upon a, a, another lie. And the bottom line is we still do not know how Gloria Statterfield died. Right. And that's the question her family obviously wants to know the answer to and everybody else wants to know the answer to. He's now admitted that the original story wasn't true. She didn't trip over the dogs. But he doesn't say, I know who did it. Right. And the two people who were possible witnesses, a jury has now found he, that he was guilty of murdering them. And so uh, all kinds of questions about why would you lie about another death on your property? I mean, do we know, Laura, if there's even any more money to collect from Alec Murdoch at this point? Well, his, that's part of why his attorneys, I think, are pointing the finger at this family, basically saying all of the money that he would have had is caught up with creditors because, again, he's facing all of these alleged financial crimes, including uh, defrauding his, uh, his own law firm. The family did get some settlement money, but yes. they say not this money that this insurance company, Nautilus, is after. Precisely. They say it came from a whole other different pot of money from going after his old firm. Again, a lot of fighting, a lot of griping on both sides here, but the, the core answer we still don't have any real clarity on. Yeah. We, we might not get any real clarity yeah. on. All right. Yeah. Thank you, Lord Jerry. The family feud yeah, back. Yeah, a couple years ago. It is. I mean, and, and the boys especially. Um, because they said to me then, and I remember it, st it stayed with me. They were like family. Mm. They thought they saw the Murdochs as like like family. They were in any out of each other's almost twenty always. years. She worked. Yes, yeah. yes. So yeah. to take money from from them is just takes a special kind of person to do that. Yeah. All right. Thank Laura. you, Laura. Thank you. Yeah. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com/slash/all day or. Click the link right here.